Number three word I want to deal with here is the word backsliding. These are words that confuses salvation. These are concepts. I don't know how they came into the church, but they've been in the church world for a long time and Christians have embraced it. Backsliding. Technically, a Christian cannot backslide. Technically. Because the word backslide scripturally means to go back to idols. Going back to idols. That's the meaning of backslide scripturally. I'm not talking about English di dictionary. The Bible is not an English book. It's not an English book. The English is not the primary language of the scriptures. No. Okay. So the word backslide technically means to go back to idols. A believer doesn't go back to idols. We are not of they that go back. We are of they that press forward. To the saving of the soul we don't go back we press forward what has been injected in us does not go back it's eternal life i thought somebody would shout very loud at the top of your voice i house eternal life say let every wizard hear you very loud now say in my body is a temple the house the dwelling place the residence of the holy ghost uh, can i hear powerful amen? amen can holy ghost and evil ghost live in the same house it's not possible your body is the temple of the holy ghost thank you lord teaching good this morning going back to the world <laughs> i will never never go back to the world never go back to the world you are fighting the bible because the bible says go into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature and you're busy singing i will never never go back you better go back there are people there you need to go and help so that word we have to explain them in context it has to be explained in context Because if it is not well explained, it, it, for a believer that is not well taught, it means to lose salvation. That's why it has to be well explained. And when Hosea, when Hosea used that word going back to the world, what he actually meant in context was going back to idol worship. Going back to idol worship. That word going back to the world is not in the epistles because it's not our language you won't find it in the epistles it's not the language of the believer no it's not our language going back to the world are we here it's not our language only peter talked about something like that a dog going back to his vomit and remember he didn't say a new creature going back to his vomit he said a dog so the question is are you a dog or a new creature which one are you so if you're a new creature you're not a dog it means you will not go back to your vomit you have no vomit because the bible said there are some people among us who are dogs yes among us they are dogs who are dogs they are people that come among us they refuse to believe the gospel but they want to be among us so they put on a regalia that makes them look like us but inside them they are dogs he said without are dogs without means these people are not born again you can't be born again and be a dog no a born again man is a new creature he's the righteousness of god he's a saint he is sanctified i feel like i'm preaching here somebody say very loud i'm not a dog i'm a new creature I have no vomit to go back to. 